there, it's time again for another two minute guitar lesson. This one might even be one minute, <laughs> there's so little to it. But it's a nice little fun song and it's one song that I use uh, for students who are just making that transition from reading notes off the page uh, to maybe starting some chords. Uh, back in the day when this was popular, we, I've taught it a number of times. Uh, and it's a great little song, let's check it out. So it starts with some power chords and the great thing about you know these power chords is they stay all on the sixth string. You're just walking it down. So we have an A5 here, a G5, an F sharp 5, an F5, E5. Also gives a, a student a chance to, to learn the fretboard. You should know your notes, okay? Because you know, you're gonna use these same chords and a ton of other things. Uh, another thing that we get to do, uh, maybe we haven't gotten to 16th notes and that's what this thing is all about. Uh, so let me just run through it for you. Here we go. Three and four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and four e and a one e and two e and a three e and four e and one. Now, when I play this, uh, I'm using the typical one three finger combination. Uh, these are power chords, so if you're new to those, what those are are just uh, the name of the, of the chord. You'll see the letter and the fifth note above it. Uh, and typically, we play um, two strings with the uh, with the third finger, just pressing d those down like that. That's just the root, the fifth, and the octave above that. And so, as we slide it down, this A, that's what that note is here on the fifth fret: G, F sharp, F and E, and then when I go here uh, to the E, I'm gonna play with my second finger because I can reach it. But if you have to uh, put your first finger there, that's cool. Um, but you do need to switch it back. And so that's why I kinda like to just sort of glide this down like I'm riding a, a, a rail and then put the second finger there and then just slide on back here. A couple other things that you might uh, see and or hear, um, those you know, there's a lot of distortion in this. And so when he uh, gets to the, in between the verses, uh, what Billy Joe is just doing, he's just sort of scratching these strings and just keeping your fingers light. You get these pitches, these are harmonics, and they just sort of occur where you are. Um, that's a longer lesson, maybe not for today. Um, other times you might hear and those are just the open strings. So really not much to it. Practice it. Make sure you're counting. Uh, if there's another song that you want to learn, uh, let me know. Maybe I can, I can fit it in two minutes. You know, just leave it in the comments. Uh, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. I'll see you next time. Take care.